Good morning, everybody. I Apple Guy Kingsley here. Got to make sure that you're not in the light there. Ugh. Um, I'm sitting in the dark of my computer watching porn. No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm sitting here actually. Uh, and I was trying to decide. I was going to do this earlier, but um, work stuff. But um, today's going to be a pretty simple vlog, actually. Um, I was thinking about uh, the friends of mine uh, who are in the Northeast, and then um, one of my best friends who's here right now, uh, who are facing, you know, difficulties in life right now, in one course or another. And uh, really all my friends who might be facing challenges right now. Uh, uh, a, uh, a woman who I was close to at one point, she's... Struggling to go see her father for the first time. Need to get online and help her if I can. Um, but anyways, so all this said, running through my head like a hamster on a wheel, made me think of this uh, of this proverb that uh, was gifted to me from um, Joanne Farabee, my theater teacher from uh, back in the day. <clears throat> she and her husband were really good to me, and um, it wasn't too long after her husband passed that she gave me this framed copy of this uh, Sanskrit proverb uh, that I still have to this day, actually, and uh, written in sort of a calligraphy. It was really elegant and beautiful, and it's a reminder of this moment, not the past, not what's coming but right here and right now, um, because it will never come again. And some moments I think you want to pass, but at the same time you also have to be appreciative for the moments that you have right here and right now. Um, because even if it's in the midst of tragedy when this moment occurs, it's the moments where you connect with people and that you remember and look back on happy times that, you know, you'll remember later down the line, the way you deal with today. So, <clears throat> try a little punch, punch drunk, but um, anyways, what I wanted to do was to read this proverb to you, because I think it's very beautiful. And for my friends, uh, immediately I know Robert, Sheila, Doug, Chris, Jennifer, uh, especially for you, who I know is going through a challenging time right now, um, I'm thinking of you, and I wish this for you. And for anyone else going through challenging times, I wish this for you, and happy moments right here and right now. Uh, so, anyway, the uh, it's a Sanskrit proverb written by Kalidasa, K-A-L-I-D-A-S-A, Kalidasa, and it goes a little something like this, <coughs> me, 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 okay, no, I don't need to do that, <laughs> look to this day, for it is life, the very life of life. In its brief course lie all the verities and realities of your existence. The bliss of growth, the glory of action, the splendor of achievement are but experiences of time. For yesterday is but a dream, and tomorrow is only a vision. But today, well lived, makes yesterday a dream of happiness and every tomorrow a vision of hope. Look well, therefore, to this day. Such is the salutation to the ever new dawn. I'll put a link uh, for this in the description, so you can go and look at it from allpoetry.com is where I'm looking at it from right now. And I hope, you know, 
that you find some connection to it or, you know, it, it works for you in some way. If not, look up some of your, you know, just go look on poetry. You can find a lot of truth and, you know, beauty in poetry. And you don't have to be looking for dramatic poetry. This could be taken dramatically. It could be taken, you know, melancholy. It could be taken... Uh, it could be taken very happily. I think it's sort of a happy quote. <clears throat> I just sound a little bit tired. I could be like, hey, look to this day, for it is life. It is the life of life. Or it could be a bad Shakespearean actor. Look to this day, for it is life. A very life of life. In its brief course. <clears throat> I hurt my throat. Anyway, uh... <laughs> So uh, I hope you find a connection to this and it helps you. And once again, to the people who uh, are close to me, I'm thinking of you and I'm wishing you happiness and safety and security in the important senses. And um, you have my love and my support. If you need me, let me know. I'm here. And to all of you, thank you for watching. Take care of yourself and each other. No. Um, <laughs> I'm Jerry Springer. Uh, take care of yourself and each other. Oh, wait, I got a transsexual over here. Hang on. No. Uh, I'll see you next time. We got some fun ones coming up, by the way. Uh, keep shaking the camera. I got to stop hitting myself. Bitch. No. Um... We have some fun ones coming up. The Simon Says Challenge is coming up and the Water Weight Challenge. Both of them, I think, are pretty funny and you can participate if you want to. So, I will see you next time. Live with passion.